Hey, what's up, y'all? It is me, Adrena Monet. Just wanted to bring this very short segment to you on um, a recent vid I did and conversation that was had uh, with my people on TikTok. So I just wanted to go ahead and share this one brief clip with you and encourage you to also connect with me on TikTok if you feel led to or even share out my TikTok um, channel and everything with people um, that you know are fellow Nuggaby survivors or just enjoy a good life hack or product review or all of the above or whatever the case may be. Um, for people that you know, uh, gentlemen, ladies alike, who you know um, would like to be connected with me on TikTok, be sure to share out my TikTok as you feel led to as well. The username is right on the screen uh, for you to easily have and I'll probably link, I guess, uh, the information in the video description as well. So without further ado, go ahead and enjoy this next segment. And that's all I've got for now. Peace, peace. But yeah, I do realize, you know, we each have fairly unique circumstances, but we do have quite a few commonalities in our situations as well with these narcs and their lap dogs. So as far as the lap dogs go, make sure you're no contact with them online, offline, and everywhere in between. Okay. Um, second of all, don't try to play dirty with them because I mean, they're sadistic. They are as sadistic, evil, conniving, and garbage, you know, demonically, just demonic trash like the sociopath or psychopath is. And so, um, you want to make sure that you just don't, it just takes too much to be that level of evil and devious, okay? Also, make sure you are surrounded um, as much as possible and you engage with people that obviously are not going to gaslight you and validate your entire narc experience. And just uh, mind the company that you start to keep um, along your journey of healing and recovery.